व्यूअर्स वॉयल वॉर इन टिगराए इज अंडरवे टिगराएज नेबर्स रीजनल गवर्नमेंट्स बॉर्डरिंग टिगराए आर एनेक्सिंग एज मच लैंड ऑफ टिगराए एज पॉसिबल इन सेवल प्रीवियस वीडियोज वी टॉक्ट अबाउट सम एरियाज इन वेस्टर्न नॉर्थ वेस्टर्न एंड सदर्न टिगराए विच हैव बीन टेकन बाय अम्हारा स्टेट Amhara state claim these areas are part of Amhara state not Tigray now and other development viewers a far region has also annexed some areas on a far Tigray border a far shares border with eastern Tigray viewers before uh, telling you about the names of these areas we know views that uh, a far region uh, has been on board with ethiopian government regarding ongoing military operation by ethiopian federal forces uh, in tigray region from day 1 when uh, ethiopian government ethiopian federal forces uh, launched an offensive into tigray a far regional forces were part of this operation several independent news outlets have also reported that regional forces of a far along uh, with regional forces of amhara were alongside uh, federal forces of ethiopia when this war started on the 4th of november then in a video i informed you some supplies of weapons to ethiopian national defense forces from afar uh, towards tigray so afar region has been on board with ethiopian federal government regarding ongoing military operation against tigray uh government viewers and ntplf and tdf viewers now according to wazima radio a locality which is on tigray a far border it has been annexed by a far government name of this place is sone s a w n a Sone locality is uh, right on Tigray Afar border viewers and reportedly here Afar regional government has appointed its local officials there is presence of uh, Afar regional forces as well Tigray uh, supporters they claim that this locality Sone has been under the control of tigray was for several decades and uh, it's part of tigray not part of afar but sone locality has been annexed by regional government of afar viewers we saw the same when amhara forces uh, took control of areas in southern tigray uh, like raya then in western northwestern tigray areas like volkayet and humaira have also been taken by amhara regional forces and that is why amhara regional forces say there is no question of their withdrawal from tigray because their forces are not in tigray their forces are in uh, raya in volkayet in humaira the areas which are part of uh, amhara state not part of tigray and we know views that uh, tens of thousands of tigrayans have been displaced from western tigray uh, doctors without borders and several other uh, organizations have confirmed that from western tigray and from north western tigray thousands of tigrayans have been displaced and they have arrived in shire Shire a town has now tens of thousands of displaced tigrayans who were basically living in western and northwestern tigray but they were pushed out of those areas us state department also talked about ethnic cleansing of tigrayans uh, in western northwestern tigray and we know that uh, uh, some amharas from uh, romia state and from, from some areas on uh, sudan ethiopia border from these areas uh, some amharas are being uh, brought and they're being settled in uh, humaira and volkayet areas so now a new dispute that uh, a far uh, region is also taking advantage of the ongoing war in tigray 
it has annexed Sone locality situated on Tigray Afar border views. Uh, another important development is about U.S. involvement in this war. Jeffrey Feltman was appointed as the new U.S. envoy to the Horn of Africa. He traveled to this area. He met with Asayas, uh, Abiy Ahmed, uh, Sisi, Abdullah Hamdok in Sudan. He went back uh, and after that we saw imposition of sanctions against Ethiopia and Aratia. Now, once again, Jeffrey Feltman is back viewers. This time, he is visiting Middle Eastern countries reportedly. Uh, in this week, in, in, in the ongoing week, he is due to visit Saudi Arabia. Uh, he, is visit, uh, he is due to visit UAE and Qatar as well. He is visiting these three important countries and Kenya as well viewers in this region in East Africa. Jeffrey Feltman wants to put pressure upon Ethiopian government, upon Eritrean government by mobilizing uh, Middle Eastern country support and by involving Kenya viewers. So once again, Jeffrey Feltman is on his way to find a resolution to Tigray conflict and to find a resolution to Ethiopian dam dispute viewers. A statement has been issued by U.S. State Department that Jeffrey Feltman is traveling to Saudi Arabia, UAE, Qatar and Kenya to resolve Tigray dispute and Ethiopian dam dispute. Uh, U.S. is not withdrawing or the U.S. is committed to find a resolution to Tigray conflict. We have seen imposition of sanctions against uh, Ethiopian government, Eritrean government. In response to U.S. sanctions on Ethiopia, Ethiopian government rejected these sanctions. The Ethiopian government held uh, large rallies in Addis Ababa, in Dira Diva, Gambala, Volaita, and uh, protesters in the rallies were holding pictures, uh, photographs of uh, Chinese president and Russian president words and they chanted slogans against the US. So uh, Ethiopian government rejected US sanctions uh, but the US is committed and US is going to put more pressure upon Ethiopian government views. US has warned of further actions against Ethiopian and Eritrean individuals if this war goes on. That is why viewers, we have seen that uh, Jeffrey Feltman is once again on his way to the Middle East and to this region. After this visit, we could see further pressure upon Ethiopian government to find a way out of this crisis. Thank you for watching.